Hello and greetings, my fellow Long Darkians, and welcome to a map tour of Shattered Marsh. A due reminder, this is a modded map tour from the Long Development Modders. They've been working on this for over three years. They do have a couple more regions in. I did the last uh, video, I covered Precarious Causeway, which leads the transition area, does go into here. Uh, we'll try to get the other. There's another map, Forsaken Shore. I will try to get that in about a day or two, working uh, around the clock there. So you're to subscribe for more Long Dark content. Uh, get notifications on our playlist for the Long Development mod. I've kind of included, it's a little bit of a treat I've included in our regular uh, couple series we got going on. Our Interloper series, the Blizzard series, probably get in misery too. Because uh, that's going to really hurt. They're not too bad. I haven't found this one fairly enjoyable, but alright, let's get out. I'm gonna get some sticks real quick. And I covered a little bit of this on the live stream today, so I have a good idea of the map size on this. I'm gonna get a couple sticks just in case we do need a fire. We are playing on Pilgrim though, so it, it'll be pretty easy. I try to make that just so the weather's nicer, we get a nicer view. I can just, you know, not worry about surviving. We can just show off the map. All right, so we're the Luminous Cavern we just came out of, which is connected to the uh, Curious Causeway, which you get to from Desolation Point. Now, we actually have two ways we can go here. I'm going to actually go up on this side. I'm going on Carrying Way. Try to keep it kind of light. I do apologize. I know some people, like, we have to pick up everything in every Long Dark video. I apologize if I don't pick up everything, but this is a map tour. We're not hoarding. <laughs> That's because we got to kind of keep the weight a little light. Otherwise, I know you're feeling I would be grabbing everything too. Let's go over here. I want to check out this first. And I think for the map size, what I know so far, I should probably be able to get this in one video. Uh, might take two. And hello, hello. I did not see you on the live stream today. We kind of got to Shattered uh, Marsh at the last second, so I didn't really get a good chance. Okay. Well, let's head here first. Grab some mushrooms just in case. I mean, we've got a pretty good supply of stuff. And a couple cool surprises in the Forsaken Shore. Um, Mod, map, map mod that I do want to show off as well. That is pretty nice. Well, I've had a great time. And also, to be aware, you need to own, on PC, of course, uh, the Long Dark and the DLC to be able to work this mod. I still set up. And I was hoping it wasn't light fog. I'd like to get a good view of this right here. And also to be aware, currently, uh, at the time of this, this mod is kind of early access. They don't have maps working or, you know, so no charcoaling. I can't do that in this map tour. Uh, and there's no beach coming. Also, I would try to map this out, but it's a little precarious because there's a lot of thin ice out there. So I did end up going around. Because it's, yeah, it's a little rough. Oh, we got a fire barrel as well. Nice. Couple lockers. Oh, I like this. This is nice. Think about these watchtowers. You usually don't get a decent amount of uh, storage space if you were going to stay out of one. See, we spend a little bit of time here. See if the uh, light fog clears up. Now, is this a little bit custom? Because I don't remember. Remember, gener this the wood here looks a little. Oh, hello. I think this is okay. Yeah, they did the kind of this right there and all of that. Yeah, that's really cool. I like it. I think I can use this. And we get the Forester's revolver. Probably good pro tip. Don't point that at yourself. I 
And I said we're gonna loot, and then I proceed to loot, but I can't help it. Fishing tackle. Yeah, that's because it. If we're looting on Pilgrim, there, there's just way too much. Love it. Cloth. I haven't been looking at the clothes too much, just because it's Pilgrim. It's not like it's cold anyway. Windbreaker. Hey, I wouldn't say no. Yeah, these backpacks don't kind of bug those. None of those work. Water, water, water. I will grab the revolver ammunition. The matches. I'm not going to... We don't need that right now. Acorn grounds. Oh, cool. Very nice. Double canisters. There is a little bit of toxic fog. I think at least in the... Yeah, it is in this map. Yeah. The Shattered March, there is a little bit of toxic fog. Uh, nothing terrible that I saw yet. But yeah, you can get past it pretty quick. Okay. Otherwise, I'm going to grab one more. That doesn't work as well. Okay. Well, I'll grab. I think they put some water just in place because you can't get to that. Makes sense. I'm going to take a little bit of a, just like an hour nap. See if this clears up so we can get a good view of this. Sometimes taking a nap helps. Well, we're getting a little bit of light snow now. A little bit of light fog. Ah, it's beautiful. Got a nice picture of this tower, too. And there's a rope over there as well. Okay. Very nice. Yeah, I just want to see where this goes. We're going to go off to our left, I think. See how far that goes. And there's a rope on top. That's a lot of rope, actually. So it looks like it goes around. Okay, okay. That would end up in the same area. Okay, well, we can go that way. Not a big deal. That does kind of make sense. Yeah, I have, I have not found it yet. I will keep trying. A really easy way to get straight through. I had to go on the left side, or like right over here, on the edge. Otherwise, we would have ended up in the little bit of cold water. All right, so let's head off to the right. I think I know where this goes. But I'll try not to pick up too much stuff so we can stick to the script, as they say. Yeah, but this was all uh, uh, created by the developer long development. Absolutely free mod, as far as I know. Maybe there's somewhere you can donate money to them. And if I was here in land person, I know they're not because they're not a fan of mods. Though they, they finally did relent a little bit. They allowed talking about mods on the Hinterland forum so they don't automatically ban you anymore, but... I don't think they would be praising it. Well, I think they should, though, because mods, as, you know, Bethesda is well aware, really do increase the... That is a rope as well. Okay. Well, I know where we're going. Let's just grab one stick. Don't grab too many sticks. Okay. Interesting. And that bridge over there doesn't really take us, for the most part, anywhere. We can cross it, but yeah, it's a huge benefit. But hello here. Okay. I had not covered. I had not gone over here in the live stream. Okay. We don't have any crampons since I spawned just right in front of the transition area to the mod. Yeah, we should be okay. Let's go.
Okay. So just going over there from the watchtower. Now we've gone up a rope. Like that's any way under that or I'm just gonna check real quick sometimes there's a little stuff you just miss just in case okay now nah, I know I've probably been doing these map tour videos for about a decade now so I think I've gotten fairly okay at it so let's go check out this way I think it's a dead end, but that feels like that's a rock you could go up almost. Nah, probably not. Will doesn't do a great job at going up. Oh, hey, dead guy, though. All right. Well, I mean, at least something's going our way. Excellent. Hey, T-shirt, you know, you can just keep that. I'm going to grab a little bit of sticks. And oh, well, I see the Canadian flag. Everybody salute. Tip of the fedora. Very nice. One thing I noticed when I covered this, there really wasn't like an indoor building or somewhere, you know, if we didn't have a bedroll. And I found a cave in the limited time I did live stream this. Conflict Hill. Okay. Interesting. You can tell it's something building taken from, uh, I think, Zone of Contamination, really. Okay. And this is, I think, going to be leading to another region because they got the construction signs, which are actually honestly pretty cute. So this will be yeah, under construction. That's that's cute. I love it. And there's a bridge over there too. Oh, I like it. Hope nobody needs this anymore. I will take the matches though, and nothing in the visors or anything. Okay, well, let's. What do we got going on over here? Now this, this is interesting. Hello. Oh man. Got a lot of pallets. Fire barrel as well. Okay, nice. Cool box. Is there anything more to this though? This stuff will come in handy. Okay. Oh, so you just kind of go in. Okay, so there's no door. All right. A shattered bunker. No, I don't have a lantern, unfortunately. This stuff will come in handy. Wires. Okay, this is cool. Living quarters. The rugs. Buddy, nah, we're okay at the moment. I will loot. Regular took yeah, I'm just gonna... This is map tour, Will. I'm not gonna worry about saving every little thing. This is quite in-depth. That'll come in handy. Well, on Pilgrim, but you gotta do a lot to get attacked. You gotta... The spins are fine. We'll just leave that. Ah, I do like some food. But we'll pig out on this map tour. Rain Flare, I might need that because I do not have... There's gotta be something useful in here. Ooh, and we've got some carrots. I believe in Forsaken Shore, there's one of these as well, out in the open. You'll definitely be getting your, uh, vitamin C, as it were. Potatoes, we're not going to be able to walk soon. <laughs> okay, wow, this is... I think I can 
can use this. Okay, that door goes. I feel like I'm in fallout all of a sudden. Was that at the end of the... Oh, I thought maybe that would go in... Oh, okay, so... That's as far as it goes, I think. Okay, alright. At least in that direction. Okay. Are you kidding me? Wow, alright. This is expansive. I have underestimated this map. That is definitely a good thing. This will come Coffee. This is, where this is all uh, oh, broth. This is all pilgrim loot, and it is they do have loot for the different you know, difficulty levels out in this mod. And so far, you know, I've, I've been testing on all the difficulties. Feels pretty good. Pilgrim, you you have more stuff than you know what to do with. Not have a pry bar. This is this is bigger than a fallout bunker. The line. Rifle ammunition, sure. Oh, I will take that. I think I need to start eating things because we're getting way too much loot. Eat that. Just consume. Okay, this is. Oh yeah, and that's a little thing we saw at the. Uh... Well, we'll see that in the uh, other map tour for taking shore. I did not see there was a bed in here yet, though. Oh, bedroll. Which are... Uh, how's your bedroll? 88%. Did you forget your bedroll, Will? You are incredibly lucky. I left it. I left it in Luminous Cavern. Oh, good. That could have been embarrassing. Alright, so that is in dead end there. Speaking of dead. That'll hey, flare. Lovely. I stuck a little bit. Okay, that is... can't get through that. Now I've gotten a little bit lost now. I think... Now we went through that already. Okay, so the other way, the other way, the other way. I think there is more to see. Go through this, okay. Don't have a pry bar. And we check through that, right? Yeah, okay. So go through that, then we'll go take a right. Might be a little easy to get lost in this one. We'll need bolt cutters. Really? Okay, that's interesting. A little bit intriguing. Sack of potatoes. This will come in handy. Well, what's your carry weight right now? You know what? I could take a couple more potatoes. Why not? I do love me a good potato. And more importantly... Yeah, there's no toilet wipe. I don't think they can get toilet water to work yet. Because I've not seen a... What have we here? Toilet with water in it yet. Uh, any box. I think we're good. No, I don't, I don't need that many drugs. Maybe later. Or socks. We our socks are okay. I cannot actually get through there. I told you to stop eating, Will. Oh shoot! Where did we come out of? Gotta go. Oh okay. Wait, wait. I'm gonna go back in. If there's no click to go anywhere. You kind of just go. So we gotta be careful with that. Leave coastal highway. Okay, well, you know, I, I think we got a little bit off track then. Okay, but I wasn't done yet, I don't think. Well, that's the end of that, though. 
I think that's... It's gotta be it, I guess. Okay. So we go through this, and then we come up. Okay. Now we are much higher up. Whoa, okay. And there's another... What? Really? Yeah, we don't know how to go with the ladders down, though, Will. Sorry. I do actually know exactly where we are. Okay, does this go somewhere? It does? Oh, wow. Okay. Ammunition workbench. Oh, hello. And a drilling machine. Oh, that's so cool. Down yeah, vest. I... I shouldn't. This will come in handy. But I will. Fabricated room, which is... Alright. Yeah, that's about it, then. Ah, but very cool, though. This pack is getting kind of heavy. Now, can I get out of here without having to go back in? Probably not. I don't think we can... Do that. Can I... No. If I took out the pallets, I could probably shimmy down, but I don't know. Could I shimmy down here? Actually, I will try not to shimmy down because that kind of defeats the purpose of a map tour because I don't think you want to follow me there. All right, let's go back in. And near the end of the day, but I don't feel like we should stop here, though. And this is a pretty solid spot to stop. That is not the door out. This is the door out. Okay. Well, it is getting up nighttime though, and I do want to show it off during the day. So maybe we'll just real quick kind of wait out some time and we'll start off in the morning. At least here we're nice and safe and warm. No worries there. Gotta find a spot. You know, here is here is just as good, I think. Okay. I picked that up along the way somewhere. Wow, we have so much. Too heavy. I know it's cold. It's still good, Will. Mm-hmm. Can we pick up any other books? Maybe we could read a little bit. Pass the time usefully, maybe. Also, maybe work on the clothes a little bit if we need to. Ah, let's repair that. We'll try to do most of the map tour, but we'll do a little bit of survival when we have to. We had a cloth, actually. Oh, that is a shame. We we'll do have that. We can get rid of that decent toque, and we'll scrap anything along the way. We haven't had really a good place to stop and just get cloth, as it were. Shame, it's kind of a nice hat. Not just in case, and then we'll pass some time. Generally, you can probably pass more than that. Not we're not in any danger here. Make sure we pay attention. You can, you can, you can die in Pilgrim if you're really not paying attention, but it's it's pretty tough. Oop, okay, that's pretty good. Um, let's get a bit of soda. We'll be all good. And let's get a good night's sleep, and then we can continue the map tour. We'll head out of here. Uh, go around that other side. But some cool locales already. Alright. I'm trying to loosen our weight a little bit too. All right. I need to drop something.
Okay, lovely. Let's get out of here. I think then we go along over here to this bridge. A little bit of rose hip. Let's not worry about that. Is this bridge actually functioning though? Uh oh. Oh. Well then. Huh. That is an interesting. Oh, so if you come up here, we can't really get any farther. Currently, there will be a another region over there. I am pretty much guessing. I'd have to go down a rope and. Uh, or hear me out. Maybe we. No, the weather seems like it's going to go bad though. Well, we'll be okay. I'm gonna go down there. I survive 99% times when I do this, so... 99% of the time, at least. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. Okay, that was the 1% over there. Don't pay attention to him. I'd rather go the normal way, but we just kind of have to... Times you gotta just... Easy. And this is a great skill to learn in the long dark. And you originally learned... I learned this from uh, Bethesda games. Alright. We call this Skyriming. Uh, okay. Now this is a little bit more precarious. Um, I think if I go to the left here, maybe... Um, probably okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use that side. Aha. Well, if only you'd watch my videos, young man. All right, there you go. I think I can use this. And <laughs> canola bar on his hand. I love it. Okay. So now we're on the. Base level of the marsh. We're gonna go on the left side and then we'll go around. Like that, I definitely don't advise going through the middle. I would definitely go slow, if anything. Because a lot of parts I thought would be solid were not, actually. I don't worry about cattail. Basically, we just try to hug the wall on the left side here. But do let me know in the comments about that building, because that was pretty super cool, I thought. Okay, yeah, just hug the side here. We'll be all right. And I didn't really see anything in the middle of the marsh, so that leads me to believe maybe just go leading to the left or the right. And we'll try to come around. Because there is something at the end of this, too. But that was definitely a cool little treat. Didn't really noticing. I think maybe I see a downed deer. That could be a rock. That's how good my eyesight is sometimes. Uh, whoop. Whole bunch of bunnies. 
So check, I don't think we have any ice fishing holes around this area. Or as I could tell. Let me go see. No. Might be an area out here I'm just too chicken to try. Halfway through the day. I think we were fine last time I tried this. We should be. If anything, I can sprint fast enough. I even... Will's starting to get a little cold. I'm about negative 17. Okay, see, going up this left side, we've been safe the whole time. check up here though so will we be okay yeah probably let's just not push our luck oh yeah this is another cool area I like that because I do believe that is a custom made tunnel correct me if I'm wrong but all my years, I've not seen that tunnel like that in the Lone Dark. Yeah, it's fabricated bog. And there might be something down that way as well. Also, apologies if I don't know 100% everything about this. They do have facts and spoilers and stuff on their Discord. I just didn't want to be spoiled because I think it's more enjoyable if I'm discovering for the first time reacting, you know, stuff like that. I was covering the long dark for about the last 10 11 years uh for him came out to steam you know i don't get surprised very much anymore so it's nice it's nice all right so that's under construction as well so we might do this in two videos i think it might take the size of it If I discover anything else. Because we might be able to. I, maybe. Okay. Because this looks like it goes up somewhere. Oh, maybe just that little area there. We'll make sure we'll do our due diligence, though. Just some old man beer liking. Okay. We will stick to the left side here. Oh, another dump truck over there, too. I'm not going to worry about the loot. Also, if I do miss anything on the map, I'll be sure to let me know in the comments uh, of any locations I didn't cover. Get across. Oh yeah, just in case. Well, you never know. I will put this away though, because anytime I'm holding it, it goes off like half the time. Right, so let's follow the road down.
Because generally I always say is following a road, you're eventually going to wind up at civilization sooner or later. That just looks mostly like, oh, hey, bear. Very nice. Don't worry, I know this guy. He'll find this really hilarious. Did you actually hit him? Wow, okay. All right. Even I am not that impressed by my aim usually, but... Hey! I find Will, all right. That bear is gonna sue, isn't he? Oh man, all right, let's go. I didn't even really honestly think that pistol had the range. I usually only play interloper. So, yeah, I'm not used to guns anymore. Oh. Wonder if the owner's around. Probably not. Ooh, more underwear. Do I need? I do need more underwear. This underwear is wet, but I am not going to complain. All right. That might just be like a two, yeah, we'll see a little bit later, but a two-part video maybe we'll cover that other side going back around. I wouldn't test me. I'm one for one today already. We got some burdock root over there too. Maple over there. A very nice. Oh, there's a hunting blind I didn't check out uh, during the live stream. I didn't check that out, so we'll go look at that. But there is another custom place coming up that I thought was really cool. I would almost say not quite as cool as that bunker we were just in, but it's still pretty cool. Okay, we've got a hunter's blind. Anything over this way. No cave doesn't really look like it. A buck and a couple deer. Okay, let's check out that hunter's blind. Might have to come up around the other side. Well, we're almost a warmth, as it were. Hey, you got some deer out here? That'd be kind of cool to just let loose and maybe go hunting in there. That's nice. Ah. Uh, oh, hey, a hatchet as well. Nice. That'll come in handy. I see what you did there, Will. All right. I'll just keep going off the road. It feels kind of a more natural exploration that way.
Beautiful, and I think you guys are gonna like this place. Yeah, this is the neglected airfield. And it's pretty cool. I think I like it. I didn't see, like, an indoor location around here. But I didn't get to kick all the tires uh, when I was doing the live stream. And I have a more thorough time of it. Oh. Alright. Hold my beer. Well, let's go look and then I'll go make a bad decision, huh? Well, this is nice. Going kits. A lot of wood pallets. I'm not gonna loot too much. Arrowhead, so oh, nice. Cargo pants. I could use this. Uh, I will check up on that later. A fire barrel, which is nice. A ladder that will can't go up, but still, it's a nice thought. Okay, very nice. Yeah, there's a moose out here as well. No cave or anything this side. They kind of had this board up another building that you actually could get the stuff in front of it, but it didn't actually open, so. Uh, well, you know, I really do like bad decisions. But let's taper this one a little bit. I just can't help myself. Okay. Just make sure you're, like, in decent range of the car. Where are you, 50 cent? Oh, he ran. We well, ain't getting out of this alive. I think we'll press on. I might be able to cover this in, I don't, unless I find run into something we don't know about. That would give me some more energy. I know we're a little cold. But it's Pilgrim, we can handle it. All right, you want to go? I don't know how many times we actually hit him, though. This is a really bad idea. Oh, really? Is that what you think? This guy will not. All right. Come at me, bro. This is a horror. I'm running with the moose. All right, well, he'll scare anything away while we're going through here. We'll still press on. I don't see anything up on that ridge. Maybe we go a little bit to the left. <laughs> I mean, he's really mad. You know what? I'm not gonna... Come on. Okay, I got level two, but I'm out of bullets, so... Alright, wow. He is tougher than I thought. Nice look overview looking that, but it doesn't look like there's anything up there. I'd rather give him a wide berth right now. He's probably a little mad. Now you think he'd bleed out from something like that, but Alright.
And do be aware this is a map mod and early access development, so probably some of this is going to change. But I'm just going to give you guys a good heads up about the map, so... Some things will obviously change. Let's try to stick to the... That's what I'm worried about is I'm not going to be able to... Find the right spots. Sip, let's not worry about that. Main's concern is getting across this. This ice feels thick enough, but... Nope. That is not thick enough. Okay. This could be a problem. There might only be really one way across this. See some saplings up there. Okay, just careful. Nope. Okay. This is how we do it. I had to map out Forlorn Muskeg this way, so... I did go in the water quite a bit, though. Yeah, this is where I thought it would... There was another area when I came in initially. I tried this, and it did not work out as intended. As you can see where we've been previously. Alright. Ooh, hello. What is that? I just keep finding more surprises. This is great. Looks like a cabin, maybe? This is a lovely area to stay at, really. Oh, it is. Ooh. I wonder who owns this stuff. Little thing there as well. Let's go in. I'm gonna have to leave something behind. Oh, very nice. A Marie cabin in the shattered marsh. Your traditional standard one we've seen before, but... Nice. Uh, but right, ladies and gentlemen, I think I will leave off here. I will continue this in uh, part two uh, probably tomorrow sometime. So be sure to subscribe to the channel, get your notifications on, and I will get that up as soon as I can. And then after that, we will go out to Forsaken Shore and then cover that one. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.